What's up guys, Champion here. Welcome back to another video. Today is just going to be a little, quick little thing, you know. Uh, so there's this project I'm built out there called Smash Bros. Legacy XP. And the thing is, a bunch of people use USB loaders, right, for their Wii. And, the th and here's the kicker. Here's the kicker. Doesn't work right out of the box. So today I'm going to show you how to fiddle with it, get it working, alright. So here you go. This is what you should get. If you use a USB loader and you copy the stuff from, you know, the thing, right? You got the apps, the legacy XP, the boot.lf, and the readme, right? So you copy all those to SD card. The config is just for me, just, you know, like, uh, in the box covers and stuff, you know, which I'll show in a bit, I guess. But this is what you get. And if you try to run it like this, it doesn't work. Even if you turn Ocarina on, it'll load to Brawl. Okay, and that's not what we want. We want to load to Legacy XP. So, what you're going to do, is you're going to go to your Legacy XP folder, you know, after, you, after you've copied everything, right? And here you go. So, you got these four files. You got GC. You have RSB01.GCT. You have RSBEXP.GCT. And you have RSBEXP, the little text file. So, you, you have two text files and two Gecko files. Which one to do? You want to move them onto the root of the S card. Wait, did I mess up? All right, no, we're good. Okay, so there you go. You got you got the the, the four files. So what you want to do? Is you want to take these two gecko files. You want to you want to make a folder called codes. If you don't have one already, you you probably should have one. Okay. You gotta be. And here's the kicker. Okay, here's the kicker. You gotta make sure your SD card is eight gigs more so if it's not eight gigs more it's not going to work because the thing is 4.2 gigs and you can't run a 4.2 gig thing on a 4 gig sd card or sdh c card right you got you gotta you gotta get that little young town in there right so what you want to do now okay you want to take the two gecko files move them into your codes okay should take takes a bit if you know if your computer's slow right but once you move them into codes, you want to take this little GC text document, you want to rename it to game config. Okay, you want to rename it to game config. And this is what your SD card should look like. You got apps, your codes, your legacy XP, boot.elf, game config, read me, vote in the game, and RSB EXP text document. Okay? So that's really all you need. And you just want to eject. And then there you go. So now you're done. Oh, oh my god, encoding overloaded. Alright, so now if we move over to our Wii machine. Okay, if we move to the Wii machine. Bam, the SD card's in now. So what we can do is you just, you know, load to the homebrew channel. Okay, load to the homebrew channel. Shouldn't take too long. Only takes about a couple seconds because when you're loading it from the disc, it takes about a minute. When you're loading from your speed, it only takes ten seconds. Okay, you got You got to get them little references in there. So you you load up your USB loader, whether it be straight from the from the homebrew channel or straight from a wad, whatever it may be. Okay, Just give it some time, let it load, and there you go. Now you got brawl. You want to make sure Ocarina is on. Okay. I mean, I, I mean, if you're used to loading PM and stuff like that, why wouldn't you have Ocarina on? Okay, but make sure it's on. Make sure all your directories are correct. Make sure everything is right, all neat and dandy. Whatever, however you want to say it. Okay. All right. If you want to have your spiel, and there you go. There you go. Legacy XP is working on your Wii machine on a USB loader. Okay. You got you got to call it a Wii machine. Okay. You got to got to appeal to the audience. Give them what they want. And there you go. That's it. Now you can play on the go. Actually, you, you can't realistically play on the go. But there you go. It, it works. You have you have Legacy XP in all of its glory. You know, all of its glory being like... You know, you got the characters and you got the stages. So that's it. That's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed. 
If you did, you know, leave a like, leave a comment, and mean comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, things of the sort, and you know, I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.